Were we left disappointed or did it exceed our wildest expectations? Tiny houses, everyone knows them by now. With their adorable look and romantic appeal, they seem like the perfect place to celebrate my birthday this last winter. But the real question is, do they live up to their hype? We spent two days cooped up in just 10 square meters of space, surrounded by the beauty of nature in the heart of winter. So, what was the actual experience like? Rise and shine from our cozy little home nestled in the heart of nature. In this video, we trade in our busy 9 to 5 routine for a peaceful winter retreat. Join us as we wake up to the serene beauty of our surroundings and come along as we experience the tranquility of nature and the magic of tiny living in winter wonderland. I think this is one layer of glass, so it's really, really cold in here. I think Leah can uh, relate. <laughs> Definitely not as idyllic as we show you no, on camera. I think we're gonna heat the stove immediately, but the question is, will we have enough wood for today and this evening? <laughs> the struggle is real Maybe. already. Yeah. And so it begins. What did we say? Definitely not as idyllic as we show you. Leah already bumped her head against the wood. Oh. Morning. I am awake now. Oh, I have to go down. <laughs> your reminder to read the manual before you install yourself in the place yes because apparently there is a heater here uh, yes i didn't know for two hours oh it was a cold morning but yes let's heat it up yes oh, oh. nice that is nice oh, we just fixed it and it's heating up <laughs> oh no more cold cold oh. feet oh. Cold heads. Let's go. to spot some animals near the cabin here. The only thing we have spotted at the moment are birds. Hmm. We heard a mice this night scratching um, on the roof. A mouse, a mouse or mouse. two mice. Ah, yeah, a mouse. Uh, <laughs> a mouse. Maybe two mice. <laughs> That's uh, the only animal encounter so far. We just came back in, some fresh air, and I guess right now Evan will put the wood stove on so we can get cozy because uh, the sun is setting and it's uh, 
Time to wind down and... Uh, These moments of adventure and escape, no matter their size or scope, can work wonders for the soul. We have been fortunate enough to embark on numerous adventures and each time we are reminded of the importance of these little getaways. Whether our adventures are grand or modest, it is their very existence that lends meaning and purpose to our lives. For this reason we always prioritize these experiences knowing that they are essential to our well-being and overall satisfaction of life. Because this is Leah her weekend, I promised her that I would be the cook this weekend, so I made it myself a little bit easier and I just bought a big chunk of meat. This is what I love doing, cooking some meat and we have some uh, side dishes as well, uh, some tomatoes. Doing a good job. The reality of cooking a big piece of meat in a tiny house. Some natural ventilation. <laughs> we have some electrical above, but it's not strong enough at the moment. It's getting hot in here. So take off all your clothes. <laughs> 